Terry, a fantastic performance in the first round there. Steve Brown played well. You didn't give him a chance. You must be very happy with that. No, it's quite a solid, solid performance. I think. Yeah, I was happy with the way I way I played. Um, I suppose I'll have to go and watch it to see how I done. But only <laughs> just. You know they're going well. You keep hitting that 16. You know you know they're going consistent. And that's all you try and do, really. So an average of nearly 95 and 25 scores of 100, just a solid performance. You think I thought it was better than that, surely? Yeah, that's right. I mean, yeah. St Steve Brown's better than that. He's 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 a really good player, Steve Brown. But um, I mean, once you go two sets to nil up, and you know you you, you should have it in the bag, really. So. Um, I just relaxed a bit then and I nearly relaxed too much and I thought just keep yourself going like you were in the first two sets and I kicked myself up the backside a bit in the last leg and, and made sure of it. I didn't want it to go sort of 2-1 and then be in a, in a little bit of a battle again. The previous game before your game went on for quite a, a while, the Richie Burnett game. Did that have any impact on your practice or your, your, your game? Cause did it appear to be? No, not really. I mean... I was watching that game. It was a good game. I felt I felt a bit sorry for Richie really because he's a really nice bloke and he didn't deserve the stick that he got. I, I couldn't understand why the cred were giving him so much stick because he is a nice bloke. And uh, I know we're in England, but they should support both players really. He's, he's a good bloke, and if he deserves the stick, give it him. But he doesn't really. He's a nice bloke. And uh, Ali Pali just seems to be great for you. You've always had a good tournament here recently, so you kind of put down a marker with this performance today for another good run. Yeah, I hope so. Um, the first couple of years I was in it, I struggled sort of thing, and uh, I suppose I tried too hard, but um, now I've relaxed a bit, and I just, I, I just seem to enjoy it more and let them go, and I think that's what, what, it's, what it's all about. It's in, it's in the head more than it is in the arm, and uh, if you can get your head right more than your arm, I think, I think you're going to do well. And John Park or Joe Cullen next round? What's your view on that game? You going to watch it tonight? Yeah, I've played. I've played Joe Joe Cullen a few times. I think I've played him three times on the TV. And um, no, he's a good player. Even though I beat him, he is a very good player. Joe Cullen is no mug. And, and John Park's starting to come back onto form now. He's played a few good good games just lately. And uh, whoever whoever I get, it's going to be a tough match. I know a week to go until that game. So what's what's the, the plan now for Terry Jenkins? Uh, just go to bed for a week. I think and sleep it off. <laughs> <laughs> now I just I just do my usual thing, just just a couple of hours practice each day, and and just just keep my head right, really. Just keep relaxed. It's, it's about keeping relaxed more than too much practice. If you haven't done enough practice by now, it's too late anyway. Terry, thanks very much. Thank, Thank you very you. much.